cycle. So is a cycle or pod that visit each vertex exactly once and ends at the original vertex. So by now we know what is edge, what is vertex, okay. So uh, if you need a little clarification on those, there is a video called Traversable Network. So you can find all the explanation about the vertex and edge and so on, okay. So I'll, I'm going to look into this one here with the definition as it matches, okay. So clearly I have those are the vertex as you see the dead point right this vertex is even you know three degree of the vertex is three so basically a is the vertex b is the vertex c is the vertex e is the vertex and d is the vertex so can you go through all the vertex exactly once and coming to the same ver same point you start in one point one vertex come back to the same point going through all the vertex so obviously you can see you can actually okay so let's take a look here we want to inspect it actually okay and also I'm going to show you why you cannot find Hamiltonian cycle so let's take a look I am going to start with a okay or yeah B or any way you want to do I'm going to, let's start with a to B and B to E E to C C to D and D to A. Look, I came back to the same destination and going through all the vertices. Okay, clearly as you see, going through all the vertices. So some of you say, well, how come you didn't go over those edges? We don't really care about the edges. Definition doesn't tell us to work out with edges as long as we go through all the vertices once while you cannot create your own fat. There is existing fat there, okay, it's right? So you you don't want to actually uh, create one. You just go with the existing path and connect all the vertices and come back to the same destination. Then it's going to be Hamiltonian cycle. So this one I have that was the path actually I created. So I said A to B, B to E, E to C, C to D, and D to A. You can create many fat you want. You can have a different different fat. Okay. Well, you want to go uh, from your house to uh, your friend's house. There is uh, so many streets you can navigate through. Still, you can go get your friend's house. Okay. So um, I want to make sure I reiterate here. So this time the vertex matters. So I'm just rewriting those vertex a little bit. You know, is your A B C D E. Okay, so the vertex, I can go even this way. Look, I can even go like this way too. Come back. That would be fantastic. So this one, my path is, I said A to E to D to C to B to A. So that's basically the path, all right? We don't care about the rest of them, right? So now I'm going to create one as you will see. I'm going to create one. So let's take a look if I can do this one here. Okay, rectangle and I'm going to have one coming down here, another one coming down a little bit and connect them and this is it. Okay, and also I'm going to have this one down here and definitely this is the vertex. Okay, so I'm going to level it A b c d e f okay now question is this is hamiltonian cycle okay so hamiltonian cycle remember you can actually i can show you here or i can have this part here so i'm going to show you here basically um if i start with <coughs> if i start with b okay if i start with b and go to C, start with B, and go to C, right, and C to D, D to A, and A to E, and E to F, and F to B. Look, I just did go over all the vertex. So the, my path is going to be here. B to C, C to D, D to A, A to 
e e2 f f2 b that was my file now why did i create all those dot to the right side the vertex look i can actually work out that way too so if i connect another way i can actually work it out if you connect this if you connect that right and if you connect this connect that come back again this that you see this time only the vertex matter it looks a little house okay so as you see this is a Hamiltonian cycle okay so I'm gonna create one more actually as you see one more here okay so Can, can we make it a Hamiltonian cycle here? Obviously, let's take a look here. A, this point, to this point, to this point, to that point. That's it, bingo, it's done. So the yes, this is Hamiltonian, this is Hamiltonian, this is Hamiltonian, this is Hamiltonian. But when is not a Hamiltonian, let's actually erase this one and come off with something. I'm gonna erase this one too. And let's create an example that is not Hamiltonian, okay? So, I'm going to have this one here. Okay, so let's take a look on this one. A, B, C, D, E, F. Can you go point A going over all the products and come back to point a or any point you start in going over all the birds and come back to the same point right so let's check it out i mean you can try well, i'm gonna actually do this one here so if i start with this one here okay so far good oh i left off with this one so it doesn't work you see doesn't work so i'm gonna actually check out one more time here okay with a different thing different way so if i start down here in the bottom go down here okay oh i can trace it is traceable but i cannot come back to this point here Okay, so therefore it is not traceable or not traversable, not Euler and not Hamiltonian. So this one is not traversable, not Euler, not Hamiltonian. Okay, so thank you.